we are going to do with this uh, short presentation is show you examples of portable uh, equipment that you that the public was able to carry their recordings from one point to another. Uh, another subject that we would probably be able to cover in the future would be how you would how the public would house their recordings, how they would keep their recordings in their own homes, uh, in bookcases or under the record players or however they wanted to house them. What we want to do is show how these recordings were moved around from point to point. And we're going to start first by showing you first not only the type of recording, but the the carrier that it was uh, por uh, was carried in. First, we're going to show you a recording that most of you have never seen before. These are the first, some of the very first sound recordings on the first format, which were cylinder recordings, where you had information on the edge of the cylinder. It was sold in a carton uh, with a f sort of a flannel liner and you could keep this in your in your home and it was identified on the outside as to what was inside it. But if you were wanting to take this to friends homes you could you could carry them in a sack in a bag of some type in a box or you can also carry it in a suitcase that was meant for carrying cylinder recordings. However, if you were to do that, hey, and here you have your snaps, you even had a little lock on here. And let's hope that we can get this thing opened. It may have needed some oil. Ah, here we are. We all had victory. And look, they're all numbered. They're all numbered and then you could have a list which you would slip inside the box and then you would know what what cylinders you had in your your portable collection. And then you would take the cylinder and slip it onto the post and then you would close the top and carry it to your your point of, of uh, entertainment. And this is we do have another one that is just of a different model and carries maybe a few more of the of these posts uh, of these uh, cylinders. But uh, this is a perfect example of one of the very early carrying devices for a sound recording.